we're here tonight with you today, professional model at the TG Foundation's Gala Dinner in aid of victims of sexual violence in the Congo. You say thank you so much for coming tonight. Thanks for having me. Um, you are a very well known fashion model and your appearance on shows like Britain and Ireland's Next Top Model, you're known to people around the world. Why do you think it's important for celebrities to call attention to human rights issues? Because I think simple people uh, relate to celebrities and they follow them. So for known people it's more easier to get attention for simple people and to make awareness. And when did you first learn about the crisis of sexual violence in the Congo? What made you want to get involved with this cause? To be honest, I found out about this only when I was invited to this uh, event because before I didn't know anything. And what made me to come here, it's, it's shocking what's happening in the world. And I thought with however I can help, I can come here and make people aware what's happening. Absolutely, that's great. And do you think that the fashion industry has a particular need to speak out on this issue since it affects, in particular, so many women and girls? I think not only the uh, fashion industry, all the industries should look at what's happening because it's very important. It doesn't matter if it's only girls or women. It's We all should help and try to do something about it. And do you think that big media and fashion companies can play a role in helping to end the violence? I think big media can help a lot because they make they pay attention to it and government can notice what's happening and make a change. Absolutely. And what message would you give to somebody in the UK or Europe who wants to do something about the violence in the Congo? I think I think people should find a charity like TJ Foundation and just give some money, like a few pounds a month, because it makes a big difference when everybody helps. And, yeah. That's great. And what message would you send to the women of the Congo? If, to so say, um, they're watching you now, what would you say to them? I would say be strong and everything will be okay. There is a chance to change everything. They should just know what they can do and we're always there for them, and we try to help. That's a lovely and um, hopeful message. Thank you very much, you said. It's lovely to speak to you. Um, and what message would you send to the women in the Congo? I would say be strong, because there's a lot of people who are trying to help you, and we will do everything to change the situation, and everything will be all right. Thank you very much. It's a lovely positive message. So thank you, Eustace. It's lovely to talk to you.